Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your coach, it's Coach P here on the sideline. All right, this video right here, this will be the final installment of our man-to-man -man offense. We call this one Criss Cross. Now, the name of the play comes from the opening cuts made by the guards. This play is guaranteed to get your team open shot opportunities. Now, just keep that in mind. Now, how we start is like this. You're going to start off high um, with a 2-3 formation. The play will begin with either the top two guards uh, making a pass to a wing player. In this case right here, we're going to make a pass to player three. After the pass, one and two will then cut off a five towards the opposite blocks. One should always cut first and then two will follow. Three, your player three should watch both of these cutters and if they're open to pass uh, for a pass, then you can definitely make the pass for the open layup. Four will then cut off to the, uh, to the top of the key using five as the screen and player one will pop out to the wing. Three will actually swing the basketball to four who immediately passes to player one right here on the wing. Immediately after passing, player three will cut to the baseline using a flex screen from two. Player one must look inside and see if they can make a pass to three for the easy layup. If three isn't open, four and five will actually set a staggered screen, all right, for player two who cuts to the top two uh, of the, uh, the key for the open shot right here, all right? So again, we call this one crisscross. Now, I do want to share with you guys two things here. Your player five must be able to hold the position on a high post as players one, two, and four use them as a screen. If player five moves, a moving screen may be called. Secondly, if possible, the first pass to the wing should go to the player who um, you want coming off of the flex screen. All right, now let's take a look at the play one more time. Like mentioned, player one will start right here. He's gonna pass to player three, but you can go the opposite side. You can uh, have player two pass to player four. Immediately after that pass, one and two will do that crisscross, that crossed action right here. At that point, your player three, he wants to see, he's looking for any of those two players that are open. If they're open, it'll pass the ball to them. If not, the play continues. Five will set a screen for player four. Four pops to the top right here. Player three will pass the ball to player four. Player one will go to the wing. Player four swings the ball to player one. Player two will set a screen right here for player three. Player three will go down to the block. That'll be one of the options here on this play right here. That option is in there. Uh, you continue on with uh, five and four setting a staggered screen for player two. And that big opportunity is right here. Uh, where player one actually passes to player two for that shot, right? So again, we call this one crisscross. Like always, questions, comments, you guys know exactly what to do. You want to write them down below. You also want to make sure you subscribe to the channel so you never miss any of my videos, whether they be about my plays, my drills, or my coach talks. Until next time, everybody, from on the sideline, it's your coach, it's Coach P. Ciao for now.